Okay, we can't just overwhelm it. Do you want me to douse? No, that doesn't seem to change it. Oh, and as soon as I... Yeah, bring out the thing, it's like, hell no! If I need to target? <laughs> that is an interesting first room. We've got an eyeball. Okay, spamming sword slashes is not the solution. What good? Oh, it is just spin it in a circle. Okay. That's kind of silly, actually. But I feel you, game. I feel you. Hi. Want to see how much damage these do? A little bit. That's an extreme. It's weird how a lot of the horizontal slashes I want to make it reads as diagonal. Vertical, it seems to get. Austin just realized this link is right-handed. That's a rip. Hi, how you doing? Got anything for me? A ruby. I guess I take that. Get absolutely destroyed. What's up, B? The mechanisms that open the doors. Given their function, logic dictates that the mechanisms are positioned near the doors that they open. There is an 80% probability you will locate these. Oh. Don't, 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 don't tell me everything I need to do, V. I got this. I am a Zelda vet. Something like eyeball statues would never defeat me. Just gotta figure out which gimmick they're using. There's stuff up there. Can I get up here? No. I see. Anything meaningful down here? Well, I mean, money isn't not meaningful. Really, really, Link? Come on, you got that. No, all right. Doesn't seem to be anything important down here. Worth a check. Hmm. 
Fine game, I'll go up the way you want me to. And we will go the only way we currently can. More spider webs. Grant me flame! So that I might burn my enemies. Ah, yes, you guys. They're annoying. How do I do a thrust again? There we go. Okay, just misaligned. Pretty sure I need to do a thrust with these guys. Oh, hi there. Alright, you... Let's try this again. Yeah, these guys are kind of annoying to fight. I remember always having difficulty with them. I think the thrust is definitely the way we want to do it. No, I think I want you to stab forward, my guy. There we go. Is it dead? Yay, and we got literally nothing from it. Woohoo! Ah, that's fine. Now, I think the other thing we can do that I didn't do is... Stop wasting shots, but I'm pretty sure we can shoot that down. Two doors lead to rooms left and right, but they will only open when the gemstones are struck. One is above, one below. As above, so below. How do I get over there? It looks like a door from the right. Two gemstones. Is that one of them? Maybe. Maybe, baby. Oh, yeah, look, we can crawl here. There's one. All right. Come back there with magma mitts. Not sure why we'd ever do that. And the above one. Oh, that's that's okay. That's where we just popped out of. So that's not that. How do I get over there though? Is there something the new water level will let us do? Or can I literally just run up here? No. Okay. I see. Very well, let us exit the water. Oh, 
Oh, did this change things in other rooms too? I bet it did. Yeah, you know what? I bet we leave now. And the water level in this room is going to have gone up too. Yes. I do believe it did. Alright. What does that do for us in the immediate future? Wait a second. No, it didn't. It's exactly the same as it was. I'm lying to you. It did go up. Okay. Uh, leave this way. Right, can I have a heart so that my thing can stop beeping? Okay, but actually, where do I go now? A switch I'm missing here for this door. Oops. Ah, yes. There is an obvious switch I'm missing. So rip those rupees. We just couldn't get to this one until then. Hi, Lupin. Welcome, welcome. Here. Cool. Now we can get through here. Oh, hello. Yeah, I landed a fatal blow. Twilight Princess Link would be so happy. Yay! The beeping can stop. Ugh. And then there's another one of these. Alright. This one's on a web. So I think I actually have to approach him from the other side. And there's another one over there. You want to tip the skull, Chilla? Sure, why not? I might already know it. But you may push <laughs> So horizontal strike to spin around them. Yeah, yeah, that's what we did with the last one. I just, um, I have a really hard time getting that rust off. Alright, nothing down here. Looks like I'm gonna have to cut that one off its web. weren't close enough. I am absolutely going to die here. Oh, I'm I'm dumb. I'm so dumb. I forgot that these were a thing. Yeah, we do approach from the other side. This one isn't dangling uh, with a, a string out of its butt like the other two are, so we definitely want to... Okay, can we, can we stop for a sec? We are absolutely misaligned. Oh no. There we go. Anyways, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna shoot from the other side. Okay, first off, you need to slide down just a little bit, my guy. All right. Wait a second, wait a second, wait a second, wait a second, I'm sorry, hold on, hold on. What's this? Oh, we can do that from the bridge, though, okay. Alright. Made it. Made it. 
Gotcha, bitch. In a room with two glittering gemstones, you shall find a temple map. Gaze upon that map until your eye finds the X, for it is there that you must strike another gemstone to reveal a path. Sure likes its gemstones, huh? Alright. Let's align ourselves, and then... Can I stab from the side, or do I need to shoot? Yeah, I can stab from the side. Okay, good. Nice, and... Nice! Okay, good. Alright, what is this open for us? Oh, more water level. Yeah, we need that. Now, the room with two gemstones, if uh, the other one is to be believed, is the one... one we're coming back to in a sec. So hopefully that means we'll be getting the map there. I believe the dungeon item of this game, of this game, of this dungeon, is the, um, the, the beetle? And I remember that being really fun to mess around with. Nice. The map gives us chests? Interesting. Did they cut out the compass then? Doors in their locks, as well as position status of treasure chests. I'm able to use beacons here due to the indoor nature of this environment. Yeah, that's fine. Um, I kind of forgot beacons were a thing. Okay. So we already hit that switch. We already hit that switch. We haven't hit that switch, obviously. Interesting. Yes, V? Your health is low, hero. Do you have any food or potions? Oops. Oh, well, the water level's been raised, so we can... We can go down. So we can now get up there, go to that room, which is probably just what we have to do, so let's just do that. <laughs> do we lose stamina just by hanging out? We do. Managed to stave off death for the moment. And now we got an actual... These ones are the tough ones, the ones that are on the string. Ow! Ow! I just struck the chair of my... Or the... The arm of my chair. Should try not to do that. There we go. Alright, now we gotta... Well, I have to hit the controller too, hopefully it's okay. And before anyone asks, no, I am not playing with wrist traps. I wouldn't even know where they are to look for them. gonna be a key, I imagine? Yeah. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. We can go back. Yes, the 
big wide open room. I feel like we get accosted in here. Not yet, at the very least. I mean, there are enemies. Um, okay. Wow, hi, large sea of friends. Uh, no, I don't want to fight you, and if there's nothing down there, then I'm not going down there. That's probably our dungeon item. Do you not remember much of the rest of this dungeon? Which is not to say I remember much of what has already happened. If I meant to do a final blow there, but that did not work out. Alright, so we cannot go that way yet. Hi. Yeah, I have a hard time getting the thrust off for some reason. I'm not sure if it's the Joy-Con, my setup, or the game itself. So we can go into the center area. Hi, don't attack me, please. Oh, here, and I wanna, I wanna test this really quick. Stop swinging. No, if you can uh, cut this string, it's not with that. Use your hips, lol. Thrust harder, baby. Yeah, I feel like we need the beetle to break these. Oh, I'm out of shots. So that's fun. That's fine. Let's go in the center room, see what we see. If I need uh, ammo, there will be a, a bush or something in here we can farm. Yo, what's up? Nice defense. One of the reason why I really like Skyward Sword is the uh, the the actual like sword combat between you and enemies is really fun. I love that they actually put up like a strong defense, and you kind of need to be good at it for some of the enemies later on. Yeah, there we go, the beetle. The unexplained power contained within this insect-shaped item allows you to control it as it flies through the air. You have acquired a new item. Analysis of this object's insect-like profile and wings indicates it can fly. After launching it, you can remotely pilot the device. The sharp structure on the front of the device can sever threads and deliver a blow to smaller objects. Impressed one more, but okay. So let's heal a little bit. Cool. So now what we want to do is get it ready and boom. 
Now it's not infinite, uh, it will eventually run out, but uh, you can pile it for about as long as you can control it. And it doesn't hit anything. I think uh, one of the upgrades you can get actually makes it infinite. I didn't I didn't want you to return it. Keep going. There are many things to do. Can't boost it. Now, what did dropping that box even do? Oh, and there is a proximity thing. Like, you can't get too far away from it. The beetle. I'm not sure if it's proximity or time that we're hitting now. Alright, well, either way, I can leave this room, which should help us. See where that box fell, though anything it dropped is probably gone. But oh, it's a fairy! I see. Well, then, in that case, um, and nice. Playful sprite replenishes six of your hearts and will automatically heal you if you run out of hearts. Nice. Um, okay, let's finish this little tunnel here. But I did get all the money that was in there. That's decent. I think that was like right at the end there. Yeah, okay. But what is in this one? Oh, we took a hit. It does seem to be time because, uh,. We see we're right there. Playful sprite in prison and in a bottle with no air holes. What fun. Exactly. Good times to be had by all. What about the ferret? By all. Come charging out of the hole at me. No? You tend to stay up there now that you've been loosed? Works for me. Yeah, that's fine. There's no anything else in there. What about up here? Take that. Okay. Another one up here. I'll take all the red rupees you want to give me. We did that one. I suspect. In fact, we did this one, but I'm going to check anyway. Nice. 
think that was the end of that path because then it kind of hits this tree thing here. But I'll double check. Yeah. Okay, so that is all of those. Anything on the roof? Actually, now that you mention it, anything super high up here? Yes. Oh, excuse you. I'll get a bit closer. Might be distance and time. And what did that do for us? Oh! I didn't even notice that was there. Shit, we'll take that. on the literal other side, Shadow. Come on. Nice. Absolutely take that. Alright, I think that's all of this room explored. Now I can go that way. Yeah. I saw something lurk. No lurking. Unacceptable. I mean, the lurkers in, 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 in the stream, you guys are fine. No lurking in this area, because that's dangerous. Can I cut these? Nope. They are blocks. But I can go this way. Sure. We'll do that first. Because there's a chest in here. I like those. Ooh, hello. No webbing. How are we going to do you? Are you going to, like, rear up or something? Oh! That's entirely unacceptable. Yeah, you just, you just climb right on. Okay, um, oh! Hi, can you not? Hi, the final boss three. How's it going? I, uh, I, I, I didn't care for that. That was... mildly perturbing. Oh, I should probably go grab that chest. Oh, it's still locked. Oh, behind these, though. Motion controls? Yep. Full motion. Do I have to... Does the third eye open up? I'm pretty sure I'm going to have to do all of them at once. Yeah, okay, we're going to have to be up here, I think. I just maybe do one eye at a time. No, okay. the box over oh you're right you're right that's probably it assuming it doesn't break on us and it uh, just lands then yeah we could probably stand on that yeah okay okay fair enough 
I didn't even see the um the outline here too. That's that's definitely code for hey, there's a box you can shove here. Yeah. Okay, can only shove. Yes, sir. There we go. Thank you. Sometimes I can be very blind. Okay, a little bit more. And I have played this one before, but I've only played it once. Played this game like a hundred times. Cool, cool. Oh, hey, thanks for the follow. Welcome to the kingdom. Oh, I am on the wrong scene again. There we go. That notification might still play, but it, it might not. My alerts are jank. <laughs> I need to put some serious work into fixing them one of these days. Yay, give me my thing. Do we still do boss key in uh, Skyward Sword? Well, it's a small key for now. I think we do boss keys or big keys or whatever. I could be mistaken. Alright, now... Oh, that's, that's in the last room. Although... Maybe there's goodies in here too? I mean, there's this other box here. I should at least cut that. Oh, this is for a heart. Boo, sir! Boo you! Alright. There does not appear to be any good for cutting those. That's fine. We'll go. But I'll take my beetle with me! Aw. I didn't get the heart. That actually might have been a rupee now that I think about it. Looked like a heart though. Okay, and then here we want to go. Boop. And. Boop! What did that do for us? Oh, water level again. Place becoming a uh, low key water temple how often we're raising the water level. <laughs> Buddy, there you go. Hi. I am not I'm not your dinner. Promise, bro. Um Did I get any more ammo? I didn't. Will this work? Oh, well, knocked his ass down. I'm not a fan of that. Oh! If we do um, a vertical skyward or a vertical uh, spin dash, that flips them onto their back. That is a good to know. What was the point? Oh, because the water. Because of the water level, that's why. We no longer could get back this way. Alright, well, do your swim of shame, Link. There you go, friendo. Alright, so that got us a key. That's gated. That one is apparently locked. Oh, right. Right, right.
I don't think I'm gonna make this turn, but I'll try. No. Now, I think those actually died down there, but there's this guy. Still want these seeds, though. Oh, there's two of them. That's wonderful. Why you would climb up that right path, I do not know. And then we wibbly wobbly. We do our little back and forth swagger. Dance our way across the tightrope. Beautiful. Daldra. Snake monster from before the dawn of time, three bone-plated heads, and a thirst to cause pain, keep it writhing even beyond death. My analysis shows that to defeat this cursed snake, all three of its heads must be simultaneously destroyed. Oh cool, and if we kill more than one of them... Um... We start getting stats about them. For all enemies too, I assume. That's cool. I like that enemy. I, d I don't remember it in the slightest, but uh, it's a fun one. You have to defeat all three heads with one strike. Is it just a heart in here? It's looking like it's just a heart in here. Yeah, okay. Two more chests. What do you have to say about this? Green Bacoblin enjoys dark places such as caves. Its sunlight deficient lifestyle has turned its skin a stomach turning shade of green. I don't like its green. However, like its red brethren, it exhibits a fascination with festive undergarments. My battle performance rating with this enemy is very strong. You don't say. I think we want to do stuff with the beam here in this wide open area. Might not be able to do anything with it yet, though. Really? I totally thought you'd be able to cut that. Alright. I'm super late to the party. Hey, Shadow. Hey, Jack. You're okay. Beetles in Skyloft. We went up to visit his shop. We got, um... The maximum amount of wallet upgrades we have, uh, we, we can have as much money as we're allowed to have in the game. And uh, we're about halfway through the Forest Temple. No Silent Realm, despite the fact that I said it's in the, uh, I said it in the title. It seems I was mistaken, and that must be something that comes um, on our second round of temples. You know what I mean? Like how in Zelda games there's a first round of temples, and then something happens, and then you do the second round of temples. Uh, that's definitely the chest that houses the boss key, or the big key, or whatever they're gonna call it in this one. Time to go to the minigame out there. Hey friend, do you think you might mind getting the hell off my, my rope? Thanks. Whoop. Cool. A lot of hearts here. More tightrope. 
walking. Um, that's not quite how you do that, there, bud. Once you, once you. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, I bet you it's a swinging one, and I have to cut it. Yeah. I totally thought that was a tightrope, but I also wasn't looking closely at it. Let's just see if there's anything we need the beetle to do. Oh, that guy's back. You can cut these, right? No, we can just ignore them entirely. Okay. Oh yeah, and our dungeon item is this beetle that we can remotely pilot. We also got the slingshot, uh, but I think we got that last episode. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One of the um, the Kikwis gave it to us. Okay, actually, we want to stop. Go this way. go over there there is two chests there's this there's this one and then this one why couldn't we get that yet might have been higher up <coughs> oh no it's it's in there so then I think yeah we ain't reaching that one now so I think we just want to jump over here? I'm a little confused. I'm going to do it anyways. That did not turn out the way I thought it was going to. I think we, uh, I think we want to try that again there, Link there, bud. I'm clearly already been there, so I don't know why I felt like I wanted to go down here. Right, that chest is over there. This is literally just the way I came. So did I just get completely disoriented and turned around? Because that's what it looks like. And I see those, I'm going to have to swing from them. I keep forgetting that those, like, twirled vines are ones I can knock down with my slingshot. Hi, please don't come on the rope. I'm, like, almost off. Oh. I mean... Yeah, fair enough, dog. <laughs> like, I just asked you not to come on the rope, but that also worked. I mean, I have already killed him once, so technically he shouldn't be alive anyway. But uh, that, was, that was definitely an interesting decision there by our, our friend. So back up here. And then I think we do this more swinging, but I need to knock down those viney vines. Oh yeah, look, we can, e we can even walk this way. Walk this way. Link! <laughs> Buddy friend pal. I mean, that was kind of my fault. I didn't exactly aim myself. At least it did aim us there. Boss key, gimme. The golden carving. Those are our boss keys. Oh, I remember the gimmick with them. You've got to, like, rotate them and fit them into the lock. It's, it, inserting the key is almost like a little mini puzzle unto itself. Which is, you know, it's neat.
All right, I'd say that is the 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 Skyview Temple completed. Interesting that they cut compasses out of this game. So we've got the map, and we've got um, the uh, the golden carving, but uh, no no compass. I'm literally just waggling my right joystick back and forth. A little bit clumsier than I've done in the last few, but it, it works. Get in there. Alright, so. That's totally it, right? Oh, I'm having to twist my hand so much. Nice. Kirahim. What's up, my brother? <laughs> Look who it is. I thought that tornado I stirred up would have tossed and torn you apart. Yet here you are, not in pieces. <sighs> Not that your life or death has any consequences. It's just a girl that matters now. And I can sense her here, just beyond this door. Yes, we plucked her majesty from her perch in the clouds. And now she's ours. No, but listen to me. I'm being positively uncivil. Allow me to introduce myself. I am the demon lord who presides over this land you look down upon. This world you call the surface. You may call me Girahim. In truth, I very much prefer to be indulged with my full title, Lord Girahim. But I'm not fussy. Oh, Linky looks angry. Did you really just draw your sword? Foolish boy. <laughs> By all rights, the girl should have fallen into our hands already. She was nearly ours when that loathsome servant of the goddess snatched her away. Do you have any idea how that made me feel inside? <laughs> Furious! Outraged! Sick with anger! This turn of events has left me with a strong appetite for bloodshed. <laughs> Still... It hardly seems fair, being of my position, to take all of my anger out on you. Which is why I promise up front not to murder you. No, I'll just beat you within an inch of your life! I love what he does with his tongue. Such a drama queen, basically. Alright. <laughs> Now, he can actually be kind of challenging. You do not want to just randomly wail around. I do want to slash at him a bit, though. Hi, please don't catch my sword. I'm not sure if I'm damaging him yet, but I don't think I am. He's going to start teleporting around at some point, too. Yeah. 
I think, okay, how do we want to do this? It's based on how he's holding his... And he dodges all of these. I think we've gotten a few what it would consider hits off. Yeah, those. He hasn't even started his chests yet. Let's see what Fee has to say about him. I have no confirmed information about this man, other than he refers to himself as a demon lord. I sense a powerful and evil aura, and I estimate his level of ability is highly adept. However, according to analysis, he has yet to reveal his true power. Absolute confidence in his own abilities, you must watch for hearing his ability to grasp your sword with his bare right hand. It is highly probable that he observes the angle you hold your sword at and prepares his defense accordingly. I recommend attacking from the direction opposite his hand. Opposite his hand, okay. Yeah, what else you got? All information I have. <laughs> Okay, so like... Okay, I think I got what it means. It's just a... a little tricky in practice. There we go. Nice. I think I hit my mic there. Sorry about that. Nice try, buddy. Yeah, you can send all those back if you... Get the angle right. I don't know why I thought I could side jump, but B was definitely not. How you do that? I also gotta remember that just because I'm locked on doesn't mean my shield is held and active. I gotta. Oh, I bet I could, um, shield bash that for perfect parry. Yup, 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 I knew it! You son of a biatch. Get out, Slade. Well, you put up more of a fight than I would have thought possible out of such a soft boy. But don't clap for yourself quite yet. That sword of yours is the only reason you still live. I fear I spent far too long teasing and toying with you. The girl's presence has all but faded from this place, which means there's no reason to linger here. Goodbye, Sky Child. Run and play this time. Get in my way again, though. And you're dead. <laughs> Lupin says if you really want to hurt him and salt his hair, what is he, Josuke? See, he was our boss of the uh, the Skyview Temple. Okay. There are actually non-Girahim boss fights, but I know we uh, we do fight Girahim a few times. I'm really looking forward to the Sand Ship. 
Uh, that whole dungeon and um, the boss fight at the end of it, that's probably my favorite in the game. I don't know, though. It's been so long since I played it, and that's, like, the only one that really sticks out in my head as being, like, a really special one. I feel like there's one on a boat where, like, an octopus or something is breaking through the, uh, the floorboards. That's a really fun fight, too, if that is from this game. I suspect it might be. Um, that might even be the sand ship. That might actually be the, the boss of the sand ship, and the boss I'm thinking of is more of, like, the mini boss fight. It's like a pirate captain sword fight thing. It's really cool. Um, is that... Is that it, though? Do we, do we just leave? Oh, yeah, that's a different... I was trying to go th out through the entrance door. But that whole dungeon is a really fun one. I think there's collectibles in some of these springs, too. Stuff that we have to come back for later. Or maybe we... Oh, no, we need the water of this one. Yeah, yeah, we need to bring, like, a bottle of this water somewhere at some point. Deal with it when it's time, of course. Hey, look, it's a goddess statue. We can pray at it to give four of our orbs and receive either a stamina upgrade or a health upgrade. Her, 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 her. Oh, right, we gotta... Master, I have a message written in the language of the gods of old. Allow me to translate it for you. Fee's dancing. From the edge of time, I guide you, the one chosen to carry out the goddess's mission. The spirit and maiden who descended from the clouds must travel to two sacred places to purify her body. You stand in one of those places, Skyview Spring. The other is known as the Earth Spring. Fee's fun to play as in Hyrule Warriors. The second spring is hidden away deep within the scorched earth of Elden. The spirit maiden, ever mindful of the heavy task entrusted to her, has set out for this second secret place. Second region unlocked, baby! Well, sort of, kind of. We have to go back to Skylaw first. We've got the ruby tablet. The weathered surface of this heavy stone tablet feels very old. I like how she went into her sword to, uh, to immediately jump back out again. Master, as I have just translated, it would appear that Zelda purified herself in the waters of this spring. I calculate a 97% chance that she has already set out for Elden, where another great spring awaits. Exists. I want to know what your other 3% calculations are. Like, 1%, she got really tired of all this nonsense and went to go find some really, uh, tasty potato stew. Um, or, like... She went to go take a nap is maybe like 1%. You know what? I, I don't want to do this. I don't want to fulfill my destiny. I'm running from it. Like, I want to know what that 3% is. Because it kind of seems like 100% to me. However, it is not clear what method of travel Zelda used to move here from here to her next destination. Or maybe that's it. Maybe she's like, instead of going directly to Elden, she's going to go secure reliable transport instead. Maybe. My analysis suggests you should take the tablet to the altar in Skyloft. Doing so will likely open a new column of light on the surface, allowing you to descend to another area and continue your search for Zelda. Let's return to the sky once more before continuing our search. The bird statue outside can take us back up. Cool. Cool, cool, cool.
Oh, hey, it's a Kikui. What's up? You can't have your slingshot back. It's mine. Hey, it's me, Queen! Did you find the girl? Who are you? Don't want to be mean to it. Oh, that's too bad. But it sounds like you at least know where you need to f search next to find her, Queen. That's something, right? I'm so glad I've finally been reunited with all of my Kikui friends. It's all thanks to you, Kui. With any luck, hopefully you'll find that girl you've been searching for real soon, Koroku. Take care, okay? Okay. Bye. Anyways. Uh, yes, hi. I would like some more seeds. Yes. Give me more. That's not more, that's less. Bonk. Um, I don't think there is much of else we can do here without advancing storyline anyways, so we're probably good to actually return to the sky. Um, we don't really have enough money to go buy anything extra from Beetle's shop. There we go. Uh, we're two away from Max. I mean, I could go buy the, um, the pouch in the general store, I believe. But that's okay. Uh, we could also go to the pumpkin soup place. I believe there's a couple of heart pieces we can get there. As well as a mini game. Yeah, I think there's a mini game there. Oh, hi. I, I don't want to be here. I'm kind of just wandering while I talk. Most of our side quest and collectible hunting near the end like we usually do, but let's take a look. That's Farron Woods, that's Skyloft, that's Thunderhead, can't get in there. Yeah, I feel like this one's worth hitting up early. We still can't open the, uh, the goddess chest or anything, but... Like I say, I know there's a few side quests involved with this place, and I believe there's a bird statue there. Although you can't fast travel above the clouds. It makes you fly everywhere. Which, you know, fair enough. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Hey, hey, hey. Going in entirely the wrong way there. Uh, yeah, that wasn't the best spot to jump down. This is, though. Ow. No, I wanted to stay on the roof! Dang it. Pumpkin landing. Man, we can harvest so many rupees here. <laughs> Gotta smash some jars. Welcome to every bird rider's favorite rest stop, the Lumpy Pumpkin. This is the one and only place you can enjoy some of our famous pumpkin soup. What do you think? Want to try a bit and see what all the fuzz is about? I'm impressed that a young man like yourself can appreciate the refined taste. Just 10 rupees a bottle. Interested? You don't have an empty bottle. 
It's mighty hard to drink soup when you've got nothing to drink from. Come see me again when you found an empty bottle. Um, can I just have it in a bowl? I'll sit down at a table and eat, I don't mind. I love how it always chastises you, but it never stops you from doing it. Yes, I see the heart piece. And the rupees, but I see the heart piece. Hi. Now listen to this. That old guy over there says he saw a demon. He's obviously trying to get Keena's attention, but he won't get anywhere using creepy lines like that. Customers wishing to see the Lumpy Pumpkin's fame chandelier should visit the second floor uh, viewing gallery. Or whatever. Seating gallery? Oh, you believe me, don't you? There's a fiendish demon living in Skyloft. I'm telling you, I came this close to getting eaten by that evil beast. You look like you've gotten a little night training, but you better keep your guard up or he'll take a bite out of you too. Sure. I know, right? You're a good kid. Hey, Kina. Hi. Well, well, welcome. I can see from your handsome outfit that, you, that you're a Skyloft knight. I hope you'll make yourself at home. Have the rupees sitting on top of the chandelier caught your eye. Don't go thinking you can get those down, you hear? You might think that you could knock the rupees down by bumping something and making the chandelier shake, but... Don't even think about it. Are we clear? Just to be perfectly clear with you, what's about to happen is entirely your fault because you just told me about it. Oh, hey. It's... Stretch? Yeah. Mm. Hey, Link. I didn't think I'd see you here. Bet you're wondering what I'm doing here. Not really. <laughs> I think I mentioned this before, but man, I am really into bugs. That's why I'm out collecting incense, insects, wherever I think I'll find them. If you have a bug net too, you should try catching some. <laughs> if you don't have one, you can pick one up at Beetle's Air Shop. I'm sure that sweaty shopkeeper is flying around Skyloft now. And then I think uh, he's who we—he's our—he's our Agatha. Not really. I always knew you weren't a bug lover like me. All right, so we can't do it yet, but I'm pretty sure it's only a flapper three to the northwest. He's who we bring all our bugs to throughout the game, and he wants to collect one of every kind. Now accepting applications for workers to plow the pumpkin fields. <laughs> why would you- why would you do that?! Get down and come here this instant! Lol. No roughhousing on the balcony, big ruckus has caused the chandelier to shake. Well, now you tell me? <laughs> oh no, you've gone and made a terrible mess of things, haven't you? Well, now you're gonna be in a world of trouble. <laughs> At least taking my heart piece. I will collect my seven rupees. Oh no, you've done it now. There's no escaping this one. Aww. Don't even pretend that was an accident. I put signs up there to warn people to be careful of the chandelier and everything. Well, I've washed my hands of the whole thing. Don't be surprised if my dad gives you a royal chewing out. What were you thinking? You scared a year off my life. What did you want again? I lost my train of thought. No chance. Uh, hey now, what's with you kids today and all your disrespecting and whatnot, I swear? Uh, what is wrong with you? Just look at what you've done. You broke my fancy custom order chandelier. You're gonna be working for me for free until you pay off every single rupee that chandelier cost me. You got that? Link wants his banking. From Kina, maybe. Are you ready to own up to your responsibility? That's right, and I'm gonna hold you to that. Let's not waste any time putting you to work. 
I need you to deliver my famous soup to Aegis, Skyloft's Knight Commander. Knight Commander is a regular here. He says he can't get his day started without a bowl of my soup. What do you say? Are you ready to deliver some soup to the Knight Commander? Ugh, you're really gonna make me empty a bottle? <sighs> Need more bottles. <coughs> Waste of a potion. <sighs> That's fine. Hot pumpkin soup. We gotta be quick, too. We'll get cold in five minutes. Hates cold soup. So you're gonna take this hot soup over to him. I'd say you got to deliver it in less than five minutes or the soup will get cold. Well, the Knight Commander you'd think would be at the Academy, so hopefully he's... Oh, that's... That's the guy who teaches you sword fighting, right? There's a uh, second minigame that... Unlocks later, I believe, involving balancing pumpkins on your head. Ooh, go through the boost thing. Yeah, yeah. Bet you that's what it's here for. Specifically, dive off near the school. I, I think that matters. Yeah. Yep. Alright, we'll check up here first. Hey guys, I'm not actually here to chat with any of you. That's the bath, Zelda, Instructor Horwell, Karane, Instructor Allen, Headmaster Gapor. Okay, so then yeah, it's probably the um the dude with the sword. In which case, I need to head outside very quickly, or we are going to have cold soup, and nobody likes cold soup. That's the bathroom. Link, you do not have time to go to the bathroom. I know you haven't been in a while. We are busy. I smell something! Oh, I know that earthy aroma! Isn't that my favorite pumpkin soup? I asked the owner of the lumpy pumpkin to bring me some, but you went out of your way to deliver it to me. That's right. Yes! Give it to me! So good! This is the stuff! Pumpkin soup is best piping hot! Well done. Say thanks to the owner for me. Okay, bye. I don't think we can do any other side quests right now. We probably can, to be honest with you. He had his lips all over your bottle. It's okay. We go to Goddess Springs all the time. We can sanitize it later. What's up, Colin? Hey! Man, when Groose gets sad, he's downright miserable. He's always in his room sulking, and when he does come out, he gets angry at everyone for no reason. Even me. The way I hear it, you're the one responsible for Zelda going missing. This is your mess. You'd better fix it. Hey. 
Hey, Fledge. Hey, Link. Did you find any clues about Zelda? I know you can find her. Don't give up. I didn't come here for encouragement. I came here for treasure. You got any? Level Colin and Strit share a room. The cronies don't get their own room. They share a room. Bruce. Can I come in, Bruce? Oh, Zelda, where are you? Hey, Hotshot, don't think I don't see you flying in and out of town all the time. <laughs> I know what you're up to. You're trying to make sure you find Zelda first, but it ain't gonna happen. Aw, oh, this is the worst. I feel like I slightly lost my gross voice from last stream. That's fine. I'll get it back. He is a very important character, after all, and we will be seeing him a lot. Karane. What's up, girl? Hi. Hey, Link. What do you think about Pippet? He's nice. <laughs> yes, yes, he is. He's kind and caring and handsome and wonderful. Oh, dear, I don't know what's come over me all of a sudden. Sorry for bothering you with such an awkward question. It's my room. Why would I want to go there? I think maybe it has to be nighttime to visit the demon. Got anything for me, Pippet? Yeah. Hi, Link. How are you? Feeling a bit better, I hope. I'm afraid I've got some problems too. Oh, but you know, I try to put on a brave face in front of other people. If you do that, the unhappiness rolls off like water on a loft wing's back. I always try to keep that in mind. It's bath time. Nope. Gaypora is not in the bath. Now my boots are all wet. Walk around with soggy ass boots. Alright, we'll mess around with side quests later. I don't feel like dealing with any of them right now. At the very least, um... Uh, Fledge isn't ready for a stamina pot. Uh... Yeah, let's just go. I don't really need the seed pouch or anything. probably go back to the uh, lumpy pumpkin though and just kind of report that I've done that. Oh. Hi Windows Update. I didn't ask you to download an update. I don't really care that you couldn't finish it, but that's nice. Mr. Boost. That's a my beat. Hey, I did thing. Uh, I see you've delivered the soup to Aegis. I'll subtract your pay from the bill for the chandelier. But you're not done yet. I'm already scheming about what I need you to do next. I'm gonna need some time to think about this though, so come back and see me later. Okay. Where you at, Kina? I wanna say hi. 
game has a lot of cuties. Hi, I, I, I know what you're doing here. I just... Like, can I... Oh, I bet you I have to catch them in bottles. I mean, no, I've, I've literally got them in my inventory. Ugh, whatever. Lol. Well, hasn't repaired the chandelier. a brave knight who slayed the chandelier. Still working it off, eh? Say, it's almost pumpkin picking season. I wonder how I'm going to lift all these heavy pumpkins this year. Not yet? Hi! Alright, well that's, yeah, that's that's another minigame later is... Hi! We have to balance a bunch of pumpkins on our head and bring them down there. Alright, well, I'm satisfied for now. Uh, oh. I'm silly. We have to return to Skyloft anyways. Because we have to, um... Impart the other... Tablet thingy? You know what I mean. Also, I love how that ledge is there, but it's not one I'm allowed to jump off of. Or that one. Gotta be this one. Yeah. Going, we're going this way. Storing through the sky hits a little weirdly different after uh, Tears of the Kingdom. I still haven't finished. <laughs> taking a. Did a lot of it for a while, and then I'm basically just taking a break playing other stuff. Like I mentioned at the start of the stream, I've really been enjoying um, Sparks of Hope, the second Mario and Rabbits game. Despite the fact that I literally haven't even played the first. And I do not care an iota about the Rabbits. I didn't pull that out. I refuse. Master, I have confirmed the location of a second opening in the cloud barrier. It is located in the skies to the northeast. This opening will allow you to access a new area on the surface. I suggest you fly there as soon as you complete necessary preparations. Well, I kind of already did all the preparations I was going to do. <laughs> jump off here? I can. Whee! Oh, hello, Boost, like, immediately next to us. I would like you. That kind of worked. Elden Ho! Master, this is Elden Volcano. It is an active volcano rich with the power of the earth. Also fire. 
Approximately 65% of the region is covered by lava. It is inhabited by a large number of creatures that thrive in the direct heat. Please exercise caution with flammable materials such as wood and fabric. Oh yeah, we're probably going to lose our shields here. In the event you catch on fire, I highly recommend you extinguish the flames by performing a forward roll or a spin attack. Interesting. Alright, give me one sec. Okay. So we're here. Big place. <coughs> Hi, red shoes. You know what? I'm going to put my shield away. Master, I require your confirmation. You are currently attempting to ascertain the location of Zelda. I know. I mean, I'm kind of just wandering around, but we'll find our way there. sink. Nope. It's not yet. I do have lots of options here. It's a little bit more um, non-linear than Forest was. Can't get through here though, we clearly need bombs. Bombs? You want it? It's yours, my friend. As long as you have enough rubies. Uh, that's where we came from, right? Yes. Yes. Okay. The magma. Hey, hey, hey! Y you mess with a turf, and you're gonna pay? Aww. Whoa! You're not. Yo, lead. I don't think this is one of those red creeps. Y yeah, I think he's right. No reason to scare the hair off us, though. Yeah. Sorry about that, pal. These monsters showing up and messing with our turf has got me on edge. They show up here, and I'm gonna knock the red clean out of them. That's what I'm doing here. Yeah, me, lead. Yeah, whatever, Mr. Too Scared to dig in the dark. Anyway, if you're looking for treasure, you should stay clear of those red guys. Huh? You're looking for a friend, not treasure? So that must have been your pal that passed by earlier. Sprinting by without so much as a glance in this direction. It was sort of a blur of movement, so I didn't get a good real 
real good look, but I knew it wasn't one of those red creeps. Your pal must have gone straight up here, so why don't you follow? The one that went running through here looked kind of like you. I don't think he was dressed in green, though. I won't spoil, but I'm pretty sure that's not Zelda. And not just because they said he. I please don't latch on to me. Bad touch. Come on. Come on. Um, no, 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 no. Hey, no. Go on. It's behind me. It's dead end path. Is there anything special over here? Two skulls. Take a little bit of money, I suppose. Is this rock? It is. I was fully prepared to burn there. Zelda has done Drag King before. I mean, you're definitely not wrong. Oh, the lava level ebbs and flows. Is that... That's totally what's happening here, isn't it? Am I going to see it go up? I am. Oh, and that happened over there. That spot that I thought was lava actually normally is submerged okay I see what's going on here uh, who are you supposed to be never seen you around here before well, hold it right there are you a friend of those red creeps you're not huh well you don't look like them that's for sure you're not that ugly so what then you here to pick bomb flowers that's what I figured. You can pick some pretty used powerful ones in this area. Look, there's some right over there. Take as many as you want. I'm sure you already know this, but once you pick a flower with A, the fuse starts burning. Then it'll blow up in just a couple of seconds. You can also toss and roll them, just like you can with some other stuff. You should practice. Huh? You do know how to roll stuff, right? Of course you do. You can lift things up to... I mean, hey, everyone knows that. Yeah, okay. Anyways. Oh, and you can, like, affect the spin, too. Although it's kind of tricky. Anyways. I'm just going to sit down for a second. I believe sitting at one of these will replenish your... your uh, hearts. <laughs> Hi, I'm holding another one. Can I can I throw it, please? No, it blew up in my hands, but thankfully because there was a cutscene, it did not do damage. Oh. Hi. Yeah, please eat that bomb. Thank you. Oh, interesting. Practicing. I will take that. Thank you. I think that's all the bombable spots in this room. Uh, yep. Yeah. Take that, though. You, uh, know you don't have a bomb bag, don't you? Without a bomb bag, you can't safely carry bomb flowers with you when you're out and about. You won't find a magma without one. What? Why are you staring at me like that? <laughs> no! No way, no how! You are not getting my bag! You'll have to be satisfied with blowing up stuff right around here. 
I do think we can buy a bomb bag later, but not yet. Okay, let me go this way. Oh, hi. That's a nice scenic shot. Volcano East. Okay, so we've been up to here. We've been all here. And we'll go in here. Okay. There's another mog, my friend. That's where we came? Yeah, that's where we came. Hello, it's down hither. Oh. I have to roll a bomb. Uh, not quite how I meant to do that, but all right. What you got? Ooh, I'll take a chest. And a bug? Ooh, that's a dung beetle or something. Can I just get it? Oh, I stepped on it. That's not what I meant to do. What is this? Bit of debris from this blowing up, maybe? Alright, next time I come back through here, I'll have to try and grab that. Unless it respawns. Might it respawn? No, I'd have to reload the area. All right, that's fine. Gotta remember to use the bug net. Huh? huh? Another stranger? And not one of those red creeps either. I swear this neighborhood's getting crummier by the day. Every day. Huh? Oh, nothing. Just talking to myself. Hey, I saw this funny-dressed character go into that hole over there. Aww. It might be the friend you're looking for. You want to know what this kook was wearing? Uh. Uh, let's see. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure the getup was blackish? Other than that, I don't remember much. <laughs> what? Apparently it's shy, but... Oh, you're proximity based. I see, even though I'm up there, it detected the proximity. Oop, not that way. You gotta be far enough away that he doesn't activate his fire. I don't even know if this, like, works. Dick. Yes. Hooray! Give me your money. Cool. So now I can pass. Hey, look, it's one of the red guys. What? Oh. Oh, what's up, homie? Pretty sure we're gonna toss those 
and ow. Get absolutely dunked on. Oh, 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 hi. Okay, squashed one. Where'd it go? Oh, did it flee? How dare it. Oh, no, it's down here. How dare it. Gotcha. One Elden Roller. These small-bodied bugs roll a big ball of... something. The way they busily roll stuff back to their nest is quite adorable. Cool. Alrighty. So where are we now? Yeah, okay, we're here. Bowling! Snake attack! Uh, wait, wait, you ain't one of those red guys. Don't creep up on me like that. Almost had to tackle you there. Didn't mean to tell you. But those red jerks moved in and been stinking up our turf, you know? To yell at you. They came up through that hole back there, so I sunk the road leading to it in lava. That'll stop more of them from moving in, I'd say. Of course, we can tunnel underneath it, so it's no sweat for us. Pretty clever, right? So stay away from the plug that's holding back the lava. It'll do more than singe your brows off. Bye now. I see. Well, I'm gonna have to burst that plug. Ah, I need a bomb up here. That went okay. Oh, and we actually have to run past those. Okay. A little bit of a spin on it. Not quite. Just a little bit of a spin. No. I wonder if... No. Run while holding this. No. I was holding down the run button, it just will not let you. I wonder if I'm just kind of meant to. Probably not. No. No, I'm pretty certain this is what it wants for me. It's got to do it properly. Why is it suddenly just not able to get across? Well. Yeah, and the fact that it keeps zooming in. Did it lock on to you to let you bomb the bomb? Did it... I'm not I'm not fully sure what you mean. Oh my god! That was almost bad. It's 
seems to keep losing Steamboat halfway through. I'm not even trying to put spin on it there. There we go. I had to just do a straight shot, I think. When he threw a bomb on the bridge, the second bomb he picked up aligned with it suspiciously well. Maybe they, um, like a tracks light kind of thing. It longs to be with its bomby brethren. Hi, I would like that heart, please. Anything else I can grab out here? Probably not. Well, worth a check. Very least, nothing at the top there. Sad. No fun game makes me, wants to make me do its actual puzzles. Just for rupees. How do I get up here? Might be a thing we can only access later. Oh no! Up there. The place I dismiss is totally just being for more dung beetle opportunities. Sorry, Elden Roller opportunities. Oh, hello. I think hello? Spikes don't hurt me. Oh. That's weird. Can I just crawl? No. It's totally not gonna work. Yeah, no. Alright, well that's... a thing. Hi, can I have that hammer? Where did that come from? Striking the hammer? Confirm taking a seat for a minute and resting does replenish your hearts. That's good to know. Bombing them only works from the inside for some reason. Hi. I'll blow you up in a moment. I'm not meaning to throw those. Even though I'm totally doing the motion. I think that bomb blew up my other bomb midair. Because it totally would have hit. Oh, it has no roof! I'm trying to throw them in. I gotta roll them. There you go. Enjoy. These are weird enemies, but I dig them. I think that's actually enough for... No, one more. Alright, now I can probably take one of these over here and blow it up. Give me my blue ruby, please. Thanks! Ow. I deserve that. Ha! 
There we go, much better. Okay. Onwards and upwards. Do I... I see. Um, I wanted to land on the ledge, actually, but okay. I wanted to land on that ledge, too. Okay. Wow, okay. None of that went how I wanted it to. We do need to land on some of those, I think. For stuff. Alright, I would like to attempt that fall again, if I may. Oh, oh, oh. Link. Man. Oh, except I did it the dumb way. Alright, well, I totally thought it would send me into the actual, like, controlled fall, but it did not. So we're gonna do that yet again. And maybe also grab this, if I may. Thank you. That's the problem with auto jump sometimes, is it can do it weirdly and too aggressively. Okay, so that we want to fall properly. Land on this one first, I guess. Even though we don't even have the Magma Mitts. Dang it. Okay, so that one we need the Magma Mitts for. That's a thing. That's an actual doorway. That's a goddess cube. That's fine. Looks like the doorway is the only important one. Let's see what's through here. Uh, those creeps just shimmied on in and took over our territory. Ow! What are you doing? Don't be sneaking up on me like that. Huh? You're looking for your friend. Can't help you there. Nobody's come through here, so... Maybe they went up the mountain from over that way. Uh, wish someone would chase these clowns out of here. I mean, I got your back. <laughs> now there's an idea. Why don't you make yourself useful and get rid of them? Yeah, like that's ever gonna happen. Sure. <laughs> Give me those hots, give me those hots. Pretty sure actual reinforcement got called there. I hear you, horn guy. Where are you? Where are you at? There you are. Can you guys climb? No, you're pretty stupid. Every last one of them. I did indeed. Are you gonna give me magma mitts now? <laughs> you one tough customer. Thanks for all your help. I don't blame you for not knowing this, but us magma's always honor our debts. 
Let me give you something to prove it. Any special requests? If I choose rupees, he gives me a bit of rupees, and we have to do this again. Oh, right! You're trying to find your friend, aren't you? In that case, take these things. There's something pretty special, if I say so myself. Dig digging mitts. Use these sharp claws to dig through patches of soft earth. Be sure to try digging with A anywhere you see signs that something has been buried in soft ground. With these, you should be able to get to the top of that ledge right above me. Just try digging in that hole below the ledge. You're in for a surprise! Get ready for a surprise! Fun time Freddy shows up. I just hope your friend hasn't been captured by those red guys. He is hoping everything's okay. Any diggy diggy holes over here? Uh, yes. The power to go downward to go up. Truly a tunnel master. Indeed. Ooh, what's this? Can, can I have it? Elden Ore. This hard concretion sparkles brightly. It also has lots of different uses. Noise. Ooh, high chest. How's it going? Now, how? Oh, we fall. Okay. It's a spot that we can fall. Grab that chest. I'd like to do this loop a few times so that I can get all the treasure, because there was two digging spots. How did I miss that, though? The chest? Did I... Did I miss a really obvious way up? I mean, I know there's this over here, but we'll we'll do that after. Oh, there's also a hole up here too. What the heck? Huh? Neat. Over by where you got the Elden Ore. Ooh, I mean, I can keep digging. That's something. Um, oh, hey now, up we go. Am I being shadow blind? I might be being shadow blind. Oh, okay, it was a ruby spot. Oh, okay. Yeah, that, that is a good reminder, though, to um, dig a spot until it fully disappears, because it can have multiple drops. This way. So now we can grab any digging spot we see. That's good. I always hate having to leave stuff like that behind. No, no. Okay, it's really hard to control him when he does that. I think I might have gotten the hang of it right at the end there, though. You want to tilt down to go forward and up to go backwards. What happens if you parachute immediately during the fall? Um, I lose all... Um, horizontally, I guess. Just, like, I can parachute, but it just goes straight down. Won't let me move at all fancy. Which is, to be fair, handy there. Or Eldenor. Okay. Is that a thing? I feel like that's totally a thing. Nope! Okay, and then those are where the digging spots are. Couldn't quite get them, but that's fine. We can make another little trip. That's a bomb, that has the goddess cube, and that's in the digging spot. 
Considering that it's basically a paraglider, it's weird to not be able to control my movement. But then again, I guess it's got no real, like, rails or anything. It's just a, a cloth that you're holding on to that's catching the breeze. The paraglider actually has, like, glider aspects. That's a thing. So bomb spots, I think. Yeah. I don't think our skyward slash will hit up here. No, okay, so we actually have to land on that one. And that one's also a digging spot. But if we land on the cube one, we should be able to land on that one. Alright, one more pass, maybe, potentially, hopefully. And I can use the, the sail cloth literally anywhere I want to just have a control fall, I guess. I, I couldn't use it there. That's interesting. Cool. Got that done. There's, uh, pieces of heart or, like, big rupees in those, so we do want them. Oh. Hello. That's kind of not what I thought would be up here. that. Alright. Where'd it go? Eh, whatever. I'm satisfied. Ooh, take that. Interesting. I didn't realize this area actually got its own unique map. Oh, hello. No, dude, I wanted you to roll into the wall. There you go. Take an extra rupee. Alright, this seems to be a weird chamber. Oh, yes, because there were several holes. Okay. literally already shadow fished about that one chest in the central chamber there in the fighting chamber uh we're gonna go with left first Whee! it was not left looks like it was middle 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 Not safe. Hi, hello, I would like you. More ore! Wow, so much ore. I, I, I'm not really complaining, I'm just mildly amused. 
And the other, one, other one will lead to right there. And it looks like it doesn't have anything special in it, so I won't even bother going down it. We are good to move forward. Hmm, I see. Oh, hello. Whoa, you scared me silly. You can't just start digging right above my head, you know? But I get where you're coming from. You never know what you're gonna find when you dig, so it's impossible to stop. Rupees are the most common treasure you'll dig up, but sometimes you might even score Elden or some hearts. So if you run across a hole and you've got the time, dig, dig, dig! Work, work, work. I like the way the rupees look in this game. You're pretty. Hi friend, do you think you could maybe stop breathing fire for like a moment? No? Alright, that's fine. Keep exploring. I know there's... Oh, I thought there were multiple holes. There are not. Whoops. Let's let those go boom. Actually, I don't really need to be over here. Fire maze. Oh, I can get in here. All right. Nice little spot to recover some health if you need. All right, so how far back do I need to be for you to stop spinning? About here. Right, kind of where this crack is is too far. Is that good enough? Nope, it's got to actually go inside. Got a curve at the last second. I might have accidentally done that, but I, I didn't intend to. I can't just do it from here, right? Oh, I can. If I stand like right here. That got him? Shit, man, we'll take it. Anything good in here? No. Alright, well that does help. Oh, I did definitely tilt that at the last second. I tilted that one too, but I tilted in the opposite direction. my bowling here. Whoops, how about I just get rid of that please? Ow. That might get it. No. 
Not even sure how I got this one, if I'm being perfectly honest. I think my, my... The act of, of sending the Joy-Con up tilts it to the right a little bit. That was a little bit better, but the arm movement I needed for that was really wonky. That's at least straight on from where the angle was, so my tilt didn't change at the last second. That's right where we needed it. Who's next? Like, actually, who's next? This one. And then this one, okay. So we'll grab this one to the left first. I don't know if we need to take them all out, but I want to. This one shouldn't be too bad. Boom. Oh, hello. I heard that ruby drop and I want it. Ooh, a red. Yes, I take that. Now, how am I going to get this one? Are you the last one? No, it's these two. Can I stand far enough back here? No. Oh. Apparently that just works. 413? Oh, that was 415. Rip. Nice. Give me that rupee. Alright, we're actually good to move on. Dwarves of Loho would be so excited right about now. We are up here. Oh, hello. Surface will reach. Probably not. Nope. Maybe a little bit closer. Nope. All right, we're gonna have to approach that from the other angle. It's probably fine. Whoa! Now there's a green one. One of your people just came charging through here, dressed all in black. That a friend of yours? See that up ahead? That's what we call a drop-dead dead-end. Well, this character danced right over it. Seriously, jumping over a gap like that, my jaw hit the dirt. Indeed. I just cancel the explosion. Hey! You, the goddess's chosen hero. Zelda is ahead. Hurry. Hi, mysterious stranger. Oh good, it waited to blow up. How generous. And this leads us back over here? Okay, cool. That's fine. I want that uh, goddess cube. Nice.
I think we are good to continue onward. Yeah, we pretty much did everything we can in this lower portion of Elden. This upper portion is kind of its own thing. If I recall correctly, uh, fully traversing Elden is actually a fairly lengthy process. Hi, I'm not here for you, bro. Relax. this here? Hookshot? I'm pretty sure we get a hookshot or a claw shot or something like that at some point in this game. I hear keys. Hey guys. We go up here, we're constantly attacked by boulders, I believe. Seeds buried. Actually, that kind of makes more sense than why a lot of things get buried. Oops. I mean, that is exactly where I wanted to be, but I didn't want to be blown up with it. And this lets us back down. Ooh, hello. Dang. Banging the wall was not the correct response there. And it was, yeah, this leads us back to the beginning. like you're waiting to uh, snipe me with a boulder. Nice. Nice. Why would I want to go up here? Yes, I see you. Hello. Also, there was totally another path I could have taken other than this area that led this way, so I think this is the correct way to go, so we're probably going to backtrack and that. Hi, can you stop that? That doesn't kill you. Let's do the trick. Yes. That's what you get for being a snitch, bro. Ooh, hi there. Ooh, 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 ooh. Hi, Elden Roller. I'm a coming. I'm a coming. I'm a coming. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Please don't fall off the edge. All right. Well, I didn't get it. Ah well. Whatever. All right. See, so yes, it clearly wants us to go that way. Also, have gone over here, I believe. So let's just run back down the sand hill for a moment. Wee! That's fun. And a 
if I had stopped to look for even a moment, I would have seen that this way is blocked and it's clearly a way back and not a way forward. But I did miss these. So your mileage may vary on whether or not the trip back was worth. 21 rupees, I believe, if not 22. Well, it didn't actually cost us all that much time, though, so that's not bad. Messed up, buddy. Hey, coppers! Welcome, welcome! Congrats, and thank you for the 33 months. Cop says 33 hit streak. Ora! 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 33 month uh, Ora Ora. Instead of a seven page mood or something. Oh, snap! Thank you for the gift sub as well. Congrats, Ned. Enjoy your <laughs> gift sub. Alright, so I'm not 100% sure, but I feel like I probably want to fill up some water here. No escape, Nettie. Just normal water, but it might come in handy. Might indeed. Yes. Do it right this time. Got two ladybugs. Two volcanic ladybugs. They say these bugs get their deep red hue from the ore they eat. They are slow moving and tend to stay in one place. Mood. You silly splitting apart body. Can't do anything about my multiple sword flurries. Skin army. Um, ooh. Oh, that's literally where I just came from. Okay. Distracted boyfriend meme, except it's just a picture of the exact same thing. This little cliff ledge on both of them. Hi. You need to die, please. Thanks. You as well, if you don't mind. Thanks. Blue Ruby? Yes, actually. I want that. I want that! Oh, dang it. I didn't get it. Big sad. Alright, I'm coming for you, boulder thrower. I'm coming for you. I meant to block with that. It feels weird to, to ZR target, you know, and not have the shield come out. Because normally it would. Um, is there anything else here? Or are we just going up? We're just going up, okay. Ow. Not what I meant to do. Wow, that guy went. Oh no, that was his boulder. Okay. But it'd be like that guy rolled all the way down. Hi, right, boulder. Can you get out of my way? Ooh, I can pick you up. Barely. What's up, friends? Hmm. I'm sure they buried it around here someplace, but I can't find it. Yo, lad, this is the place, ain't it? So what is it they buried again? <laughs> a key! Key-E-Y! Key! Ooh, key, key. They buried, they busted up the key to that door and hid the pieces all over the place. I'm telling you, one of the five pieces is buried right around here. 
Hey, that reminds me. That strange blonde girl in the weird clothes got taken away, too. <laughs> That's right. I bet they got something really valuable stashed in there. Cop wants to lick eyeballs. Only mildly concerning. And that blonde girl they took is probably part of the master plan, too. I'm telling you, I can smell the riches from here. So what are, you, what, what are you saying we do once we find all the pieces to the key? <laughs> what do you think, Igneous? Probably their version of dumbass. We sneak and sneak inside and take all the treasure we can carry. <sighs> hey, why are we so worried about a key when we can just dig our way in? What? Um, just saying. You ain't as dumb as you look. Okay, well, I, I, I do need the key. Master Link, I require your confirmation on critical information obtained from that magma conversation. The oddly garbed figure taken deeper into the region must be... My calculations agree, Master. There is a 90% probability the figure in question was indeed Zelda. Additionally, I calculate there is a 95% possibility that the key to this door is made of the same material composition as the mechanism that bars it. I have detected objects of the same material in the surrounding area. Ascertaining the location of these objects will aid in our search for Zelda. I have registered them as dousing targets. Time to start looking for key fragments, baby. I Feel more like Hawaii. A correct and valid statement. Where, where, where's the snitch? Where's the snitch? The snitch is up here. Okay. Hang on, you guys. I gotta deal with the snitch. Where's the bomb? 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 You want it? It's yours, my friend. Ooh, got his head. Don't want to go jumping down this lava river. Can I just roll into it? No. Oh no. Pop is morbid out. Oh, there's the bombs. Dumbass. Alright, Fee. Let's douse. Over here. We got the first piece of the key. It takes a lot more to get into Elden Temple than it does to get into the Forest Temple. Not a bad thing. Shadow uses Scoop. I do indeed. My Venus Adept powers are showing. Okay, we need a bomb to get in there. Oh, that's definitely a hookshot thing. If I've ever seen one. <gasps> I'm not gonna read that one aloud, cop. I don't want Twitch to take offense. Nice. Ooh, another goddess cube. That one didn't even touch it. Just lightly grazed it. I shouldn't even lightly graze it, it just passed near it. Oh well, I'm not complaining. Just mildly amused. Alright.
down there is a piece. Let's grab it. Oh, I probably need to throw the bomb from up there. Wait a second. This looks like it fell from Skyloft. From one of those. Do I, like, come back for it later? I bet you I do. Calling it now, I bet you we come back for this later uh, on in the game. When we're doing whatever we do with those statues. Um... later on in the game. I think once we get the gust bellows. I feel like that's a thing in this game. I might be wrong. Spot so good they wanted to put a tower over top of it. Stop running, even for a moment. Alright, so... Over there... Well, I want to use one of these bombs here, I believe, to open that. Oh, there's a bug over there, too. Nice! Perfectly done. I have to give myself a plus for effort, though. Lol. Hi, buggies. I want you. Come here. I got a net with your name on it. Except not actually, because I've got a lot more bugs to catch than just you. So don't be so egotistical, butterfly. And get in my net. Thank you. Interesting little plinth. Is that it? That's up here? Okay. This is the thing there. They're all getting distracted by this one here, so I might as well just grab it already. Ow. Oof. No, don't take me the whole way down, you suck. Let's just go deal with Therish for now. Therish. Anything else trigger it? No, just the Therish. Level that didn't hurt me. Oop. No, no, Link. No, no, bad. Bad boy. No sword slashy. What? Poor Link's having a rough time mentally. So where is Therish? Therish. Oh, I don't, I don't like that. Can I not just zoom in with it? 
at its current orientation. I, I don't want, I don't want that. Um, so probably about like here-ish, I guess. How do I even get over there? This was a very bad decision! Right. We're gonna have to go up. Oh, no, we're gonna have to go fully backwards. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna have to go down. We're gonna go down to go up. Over here. Nope, just the there-ish. Oh, hey, what's with this over here? I went over there, okay. Wee! I love running down the uh, the sand slope. Side of that, eh? All right. Well, I need bombs. Oh, you're gonna make me run all the way from over here. All right. Not quite. Might be I, I I can actually use this one, and it's a uh, get it from the other side kind of thing. Hmm. All right. Well, how do I get to the other side then? Looks like we're definitely going back this way. Like maybe we want to take a tumble from up top. And kind of fall into it from here. Hmm. Well, there's one like right up there. I don't see where the fifth one is. Okay, I'm gonna go back up. Super obvious I'm missing, not yet.
Oh, okay, they're two separate. One's down and one's up. But they're both over there. So there has to be a way around that I'm completely missing. Probably got something to do with it. Maybe. Can I even make that jump? Probably not. I'll try. Hey, guess what? I couldn't make that jump. Right, that's why I've been wandering around without a shield back on. I'm glad I didn't have the, the good shield on. I forgot I even re-equipped that. Oh, I definitely didn't go this way before. Alright. So that's just me missing incredibly obvious stuff. Kill me. Butterfly, I want you. I want you to be my bug. Come here. Come on. It's okay. Get in my net. All right, fine. I'll extend the bridge first. Rip that blue rupee. No, I'm trying to grab the ledge. Can I, can I grab? Can, do, I, do I just walk forward? Nope. All right. Well, yes. Can I? Can I drop down and grab the ledge? There we go. Thank you. Hi, am I am I good? I'm good. Okay. If I'm good. All right, little butterflies. I'm coming. Nice. Get shoved into my pocket! What was that? Ooh. Okay, don't. That one probably went off the edge, but this one we can get. No, no, it's okay, it's okay. Okay. See? It's all okay. Why not? No. 
Oh, looks like this is an area I exit from anyways. Alright, that's fine. Master, I am detecting extremely high temperatures from the area directly ahead. I calculate a 95% chance your clothing will immediately combust upon entrance. Please proceed with caution. You may be able to pass through safely if you run. I recommend confirming your direction by dousing before making the attempt. Yeah, we will take uh, heavy damage here. Dousing does not really help us, but that's fine. I want to go there yet. I'll heal if I need to, but I want to have a good look around. Extremely high temperatures from the area ahead. You will not survive this environment with your heart total. Additionally, dowsing results do not support this path. Okay, fine. Fairy usage? Fairy usage. That's fine. Kind of a waste, but not a huge deal. Wee. Ah, good. Immediately replenished. Is the other one up here? No. Wait. There's one like here ish. That's good to know. And where's the other one? Hmm. Very strange. Well, we'll just try and be thorough. Ooh, two ores. Ooh, and a goddess cube. Appreciate you, dog. Alright, so now we're going to want to head further down. The bomb though, it's a rupee. I don't want your rupees. I kind of do actually. Give me the rupees. We. Interesting. At least we made it over to this place that we could not before. Hmm. Dowsing is giving me very strange readings. Is that doorway lead up to the other doorway we saw? I am unable to say. At the very least, we have now linked up this to this. So yeah, there's a doorway right below us. I wonder where that leads. And that takes us up probably to that other spot again. Ooh, hello. And then what about in here? Oh, I think 
Okay, I see. We want to roll it closer to that one, I think. Not like that, though. I'm just going to back up a little bit. Is that actually how we're meant to do that? I actually meant to throw that overhead. Yeah, honestly, I don't think that's how we're meant to do it. Even if, um... Even if I could get the right angle and trajectory, it, the rock wall is too far ahead for the bombs to even hit it. Try that again. Gonna go right again. So we went kind of left last time. It's also like a middle path we could maybe take. And then I see these right here. What is this? Properly timed, I guess. God damn. Alright, well, let's check our dousing. Where's the other one? Only at one point did it ever seem like we reached two. Hmm. That does not want to seem to line up for us. The cycles are pretty off from each other. Oh, heck yeah. Alright, I don't know why that one wasn't being picked up on the douse. Oh, because it's... It's on Zelda, that's why. I don't need to know where Zelda is. I need to know where the key piece is. Silly game. Can't even read it from over here. It might not be over there. Although I think there is like a goddess cube or something over there. No, I, I, I want to go the other way, but fine, whatever. I'll do one more trip. Oh, not here. Oh. The glockening has begun. Looks like our stream is nearly at an end, and I need to take my insulin. We'll finish up out here, though. Okay, we stick and right. I'm not taking the ledge. See where this drops us. Right back here, okay. Do we want to go here now? We did not. So we have to figure out how we're getting that last piece then. Wait, actually? Oh, it's... 
like right here, I bet, through there. Hold on. Yeah, it's like buried like right here, so I do need to figure this out. Hmm. Do I... Nope. Can't run with it. Hmm. Need to get a bomb to over there so that we can drain it. Can any of our items help? I'm pretty sure you just activate the bomb if you touch it, but we'll try. Yeah. Pick it up. Ooh, I didn't mean to cancel that. Whee. It's too bad there's no bomb growing out of it here or something that I can just, like, tap. Hmm. It's clear they want me to do a rolling thing of some kind. I feel like I remember getting stuck on this one for a while when I played it the first time. No, that's not what I wanted to do. Ow. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna save us all some time and pain, and I'm just gonna look that one up. and stuff to load. Come on. Okay. Bowl this bomb at the wall. Yeah, that's that's not that's not helpful. It's not helpful. I can already tell that's what it wants me to do. Here, you know what? I think there was a video. Yeah, here. Let me see what trajectory he uses. Sorry, I know it's not interesting. I just I need to see what angle he uses because clearly I'm not doing it right. Dun, 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 dun. Come on, highly pixelated video from like decade and a half ago come on oh 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 come on that's so dumb hey look it's another bombable spot dang it that might have actually worked in terms of blowing it up yeah now now mm, that's annoying now it'll work. You can just kind of see the tip of it poking out there. Well, 
There we go. Gimme. The last piece of the key, now you can open the temple door. Hurry back to the summit and open the door to the temple so you can continue your search for Zelda, who has been taken to the depths of the temple. Right, so now we're good. That means that next time when we start, we will be immediately going into the fire temple, like how today we immediately went into the forest temple. For now though, this is where we are going to leave it off for today. Thank you to everyone for joining me, I hope you had fun, I will see you all next time for more Skyward Sword. Hopefully I can renew my library copy, because it is due back in a few days. Bye all, thank you for coming. Bye cop. It says bye Shadowloo. Out. Yes, I want to quit. Oh, I did that wrong. Whatever, I'm just going to shut off the switch. Bye bye.